what we have here is a 1965 BMW R69S. This is an absolutely original motorcycle that was re uh, rescued from a storage in Long Island, New York from the original owner. 7,201 original miles on it. This bike was uh, shipped out to California and totally cleaned and um, gone over and it is an absolute pristine example of this motorcycle with all the tags and everything else on it. Uh, very talented BMW collector mechanic Jeff Moore has had the pleasure of playing with this bike and he says it's one of the finest examples of the R69 from this era that he's ever seen and he has seen a lot of them the bike is not absolutely perfect because it has a a, a, a ding or a minimal scratch here and there but they are absolutely minimal uh, a new boot was required here at the drive line. The clutches were stuck together. We had to take the clutch apart and clean it and put it back. Did not use any new clutch material. Did not repaint anything. It's all beautiful. Everything works. What we're going to do is a nice cold start of this motorcycle. Jeff's going to take care of that for me. Notice that the tires are Metzler and they are from the middle 60s. We don't know whether these were original or if they were put on. They awful good tread for 7,000 miles on the bike. Um, included in the bike is a windshield mirrors, complete tool kit, extra cables, points, this is what he traveled with, couple sets of keys. He had a handwritten log of what he did with the bike and the harmonic balancer, uh, can't find the correct part for the very center of that balancer. Uh, it was bad and causing a problem in the motor so it was taken out and it's been left out pending the finding of that part. So Jeff's going to uh, turn the ignition on and uh, show us the lights and everything works. So there's ignition on. In neutral. Neutral. There goes a the neutral light. And the neutral light works. Horn. Horn. We can switch on the headlights. Headlights. Parking light. And parking light. High beam. High and low beam. Blinkers, turn signals, left and right, rear tail light works, brake, there you go, and it works in all the other settings. The owner of this bike was a, a master inventor. He has many copyrights and patents. Living in New York, they had a uh, toll roads at the time. He decided he needed a change holder for the toll roads, and that's left on the bike. There were two of them with this bike when I got it. Uh, all the information on the owner, who he was, and what he did will be included with the sale of the bike. Okay, Jeff's now going to uh, start this bike for us. I wanted to point out that fuel is off right now. That's off. The fuel lines are absolutely original. We had very few parts that we had to change over to get this thing going. The fuel tank was rusted and dirty. Aftermarket cap. You can see inside we had them cleaned. So they've been cleaned. All the rust is taken out. Um, they were not coated and they now function extremely well. Jeff, it's going to start the bike. It's absolutely cold. Okay, we'll turn the fuel on to start into the on position. Let that sit for a second. 
There's some ticklers on each, on both carburetors, and I, was, I just hold those down until you get a little bit of fuel on the top of the carburetor lids. Should be right there. This side a little longer. There we go. The key off. We'll kick it through once, pull some of that fuel in there. Switch the key on. A little bit of gas, a little bit of throttle. Wow. Very smooth running, low mileage bike. And it's good for the gears. You've ridden it a couple miles. Uh huh. Took it around the neighborhood a couple times. Full strong, no smoke. It's uh, very happy to be operating. There you go. 1965 BMW R69S original paint, original motorcycle. A couple very minimal scratches uh, here and there that I have to look hard to find. Thanks for looking. See you bye.